I recently co-authored a study which reported that, contrary to conventional wisdom, school reformers today are overwhelmingly left-leaning. Now, every movement requires some agreement on core beliefs, or it isn't a movement. Two decades ago, though, the litmus test for school reformers was pretty inclusive. It held that schools could do much better, that all kids could learn, and that this probably involved some role for choice and accountability. Today, the striking thing is how all-encompassing and ideologically divisive those core beliefs have become in school reform circles. It often seems that reformers take their lead from those who insist that being an agent of educational improvement requires one to think correctly about a host of issues, including white privilege, the causes of poverty, gun control, taxation, and much more. A meaningful school reform coalition can and must encompass those who have good faith disagreements about these questions. That makes finding a way to revisit these litmus tests both a pressing challenge and a rich opportunity for school reformers. What core principles do you think should guide school reform? Let us know in the comments. Also, let us know what other topics you'd like our scholars to cover in 60 seconds, and be sure to like and subscribe for more research and videos from AEI.